When I was getting it, uh, my TRP done, the lawyer spoke no English at all, so I couldn't, I couldn't ask all my questions. And it seemed like a little bit funny business. Step four is when you get your D visa. So I got mine at the Ukraine, picked it up at the Ukraine consulate in Warsaw, Poland, and then flew back to Ukraine, saw my lawyer, and he finished up the TRP. But like Konstantin said, you could go to Ukraine consulate in your city in America and go in there to pick up your D visa to Ukraine. And then he could, if he wanted to, FedEx it to you, right? You don't need him. Yeah, yeah, it's, uh, it's true. You can, you can choose uh, from two options. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you have the opportunity to come to Ukraine, yes. And you have the opportunity to send uh, your visa by FedEx or something like this. Okay, uh, but you do need to come to Ukraine once your resident permit is approved to pick it up, right? Yes. I'd like to ask you about uh, switching directors. You know, when I was getting it, uh, my TRP done, the lawyer spoke no English at all, so I couldn't, a I couldn't ask all my questions. And it seemed like a little bit funny business, a little bit, you know, why do you switch directors? It seemed a little bit uh, maybe corruption. I didn't know at the time. I thought, is this really a proper procedure but it, but it is proper right it's uh, completely proper it's completely official and uh, uh, legal and can you explain why do you need to do the switch of director because, why can't i be a director yeah, to yeah, my own company because, because uh, any because any foreigner need to get uh, need to get work permit before work as a director so step 5 is uh, switch directors back to me right or to the client and it must be registered with the tax authority in ukraine yeah yes yes so we need to change the director so you will be the director of your own uh, own company yes and uh, after this uh, we can uh, submit the document to the trp step six yeah go pick up my temporary resident permit right um so that's great now i have three years that i can live and have fun in ukraine what about renewal of it? So I've spent my three years and uh, my TRP is expiring. Is it very simple to extend it another three years? It is pretty simple. So first of all, I would like to say that before 15 days of uh, period of uh, expiring, yes, you need to submit uh, documents to renew your um, TRP. So we can just come see you and you'll take care of it basically, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. And then step seven uh, is interesting. This is another thing that uh, I didn't really fully understand uh, and we'll talk about. It. And that is uh, you need to be registered. After you get your temporary residence permit, you need to be officially on title legally, guys, at a home, at a property in Ukraine. Not just a, an address. You need to be physically registered legally on the title. Right? Uh, yes, John. You need to be officially registered here in Ukraine. So you need to um, legal legal address mm -hmm. of of your living. Okay, Konstantin. Let's talk about timeline. About how long does it take to go through this whole procedure to get your temporary resident permit in Ukraine? Yeah, it's usual. It's usual. It takes about thirty two days before getting your visa. After getting your visa, we we will need about uh, 15 or maybe 18 days before getting your TRP. So in total, it will be about uh, 50 days. Great. So about 50 days after the client gives you what documents you need: notarized power of attorney and copy of passport. Yes. Yes. Thanks very much, Constantine. You've Thank been. Thank you very much. You've, you've been. Uh, fantastic hey hasn't he been fantastic guys this is an exhaustive interview um, I couldn't find anything online that was really in-depth and thorough for all you guys that are looking at this option of moving to Ukraine becoming a resident um, one final question uh, I, I just thought of let's say I've I've had two terms of three years so I, I my TRP for three years then I renewed for three or three years like when can I become a resident and say I'm not married is that a really complicated question or is it simple?
Uh, yeah, Joe, so we, if we are talking about um, permanent resident permits, this is uh, other procedures. Uh, it is pretty long, pretty, pretty complicated, so it need to... Um, That's another one hour interview. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay, I thought I'd fire that final question. Okay, thanks again, Constantine. Thank you very much. And guys, if you want to hire Constantine to do your TRP, just shoot me an email at info at matchguarantee.com and I'll refer you over to Constantine. Good luck, guys. Yeah. Bye-bye. The lawyer that set it up for me, he didn't tell me a number of these things and I found myself in Warsaw missing documents that I need to be in Ukraine for. What? a huge hassle that was, expensive hassle.